What's going on YouTube? Javon here back with another product review and today we have the Amazon Echo Dot. Now for those of you that don't know what this item is, uh, this is actually the third installment of the Amazon Echo series. Amazon has the original Echo, they have the Echo Tap, and now the Echo Dot. And this is actually the second generation of Amazon Echo Dot is a hands-free voice control device with a small built-in speaker. In my opinion, I consider it a virtual assistant. The Amazon Echo Dot could do a few things, which includes playing your favorite music, ordering your favorite food, it could even request you a ride from Uber. That's why I consider it the ultimate personal assistant. If you use Siri, Hey Galaxy, or Cortana, you're going to feel right at home with the Echo Dot. First impression, I love the design of the Echo Dot. As you see, the top has this nice matte finish. You have your control buttons here. The base of it has a nice glossy finish. The bottom has a grip pad that allows it to pretty much stick to any flat surface. In addition, you have your light wheel up here which lights up when you alert Alexa that you need her assistance. You have your charger port right here and a 3.5 millimeter jack. Alexa even connects to your favorite music platforms such as Pandora, TuneIn, iHeartRadio, and Spotify. This device could also connect to all of your smart home devices. Now I personally don't have any smart home devices in my home but if you do, this device will work perfectly for you. You could give it commands such as Alexa dim the lights, control climate control with your voice, even ask it to turn on and off your television. Now me personally, I use the Echo Dot mainly for music, adding events to my calendar to plan my days, and occasionally, I'll use it for a little bit of entertainment as it does have games built into it. Yes, that's right, games. In fact, last night I was playing Jeopardy. Okay guys, without further ado, let's plug this baby in and give it some commands. Hello. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 2.12 p.m. Alexa, play music by Drake. Shuffling songs by Drake. You used to call me on oh my. You used to, you used to. Alexa, stop. Alexa, add a 9 a.m. workout to my calendar for tomorrow. I'll schedule a workout on Sunday, February 5th at 9 a.m. Okay? Okay. Okay, I've added that. Alexa, let's play Jeopardy. Today's first category is American History. Born in 1897, this aviator was nicknamed Lady Lindy. Who is Amelia Earhart? That's right. Alexa, Spell automatopoeia. Automatopoeia is spelled O N O M A T O P O E I A. Alexa, what's the weather? Currently, in Pompano Beach, it's 79 degrees with clear skies and sun. Today, you can expect clouds with a chance of showers, with a high of 80 degrees and a low of 66 degrees. Alexa, Where's my package? A shipment for Javon's order, placed yesterday, should arrive Monday, February 6th. Now guys, as you can see, Alexa could do almost anything. You give it a command, she responds, she gets it done. I only have one gripe with this, and it's that it needs to be constantly plugged into power for it to work. If you unplug it, it does not work. But that's a minor con for so many pros. This device has honestly made my life 10 times easier. Now fortunately, I was able to get one of these for free, but at $49.99, you can't beat that price. 
I think it's a great buy for anybody that wants to add a little. It's also a great buy for college students. A little bit of remote activity to their life. This can help you with your homework, spelling words, adding events to your calendar, keeping you on track and on pace to do well. So that's going to do it for our review today, guys. If you like this product, there's actually a link in my description box where you can go and purchase one from Amazon directly. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to see future videos from me. Comment down below of any products you'd like to see a review on. And as always, I'll see you next time.